what's up everybody skinny family guy here and this is well I'm gonna show you how to install Vice City multiplayer and you have to get this right here it'll come in with something else. actually I'm just gonna show you okay first of all you're gonna have to pull up Vice City multiplayer dot com these are these links are gonna be in the description below so you pull this up download that of course and you have to go to this site right here it should it's gonna be the second one you click click to download file then it downloads that then you can just close these because that you're not gonna need it ever again for now you go to your downloads and you get out the two items you just downloaded put it into your desktop if you would like okay first of all you open this yeah this is no use so just right click and then delete the file yeah that's all you need. you don't need the grub whatever it is but yeah this right here this is a patch for 1.0 on Vice City this will get it to work. It'll basically work already with this, but you have to you have to get this for it to work at all. I think this is it. Yeah, right there. Yeah. You go to your, you have to go to Steam. You okay, I'm going to show you how I did it. You go to computer go to whichever hard drive you put it in then you go down to program files times 86 or whatever whichever it is for you I don't know if it's different you scroll down to steam then you go to steam apps don't click on your name just common you click vice city and that's it this should already be a normal one just label as that but just put a uh, parenthesis steam because that's going to help you. All you have to do is drag this into here. Then you're set. Just keep it named as this. Keep that as that if you want to be um, like neat and organized. And when you have to, uh, once you've done that, you do this. You open up your VCMP thing you downloaded. Double click it then you install it this right here you install it to where I show, just showed you to go um, computer compact or whichever one you have go down to steam steam oh we have program files put in steam steam apps Oh, I open Unity. Steam. Steam apps. Then Common. Then Grand Theft Auto Vice City. I haven't seen any tutorial on how to do this anywhere ever. I'm about to redo my uh, San Andreas one because that was really messed up. So you go here. You go to Grand Theft Auto Vice City. You, cl you click the folder. Nothing in it, but just click this okay then you install it'll barely take any time at all so there you should be able to do that and yeah I'll show you how to well yeah you don't you don't need these ever anymore so you just delete it you won't be running um, Vice City off of Steam anymore just saying yeah I just keep the original one right there and this is where I put the stuff and this is it you'll be running it off of here I create shortcuts I created create create shortcut and create shortcut on VCMP because I'm organizable that's not a word but you op you open this and there's not a lot of um, servers at all so you just go to internet and servers will pop up I'd rather click um, this where it shows where the most players are 
so you know you can find out where everybody is I've just played on this and it's pretty fun but I'd rather recommend Samp instead just saying but yeah that's all you have to do and that happens but no worries just a task manager processes then get rid of VCMP yep that's that simple so comrade subscribe with a like and a rating if this was helpful to you so goodbye I don't know if it gonna I'm gonna might try to find MTA VC which is multi theft auto for Vice City I don't know if that's a thing but I'm gonna try to find it if so I'm gonna do a tutorial so again if you found this helpful goodbye oh I'm just kidding yeah